In today's video, we're going to explore the captivating realm of viruses. We'll uncover the hidden secrets of viruses, exploring their structure, prions, and different types of viruses, from DNA to RNA viruses. Virus is an infective agent that typically consists of a nucleic acid molecule in a protein coat, is too small, to be seen by light microscopy, and is able to multiply, only within the living cells of a host. Term virus derives from the Latin word meaning toxin or poison. They have shaped the course of history and challenges us. There are three basic shapes of viruses, helix, isoxedron, and complex. The helix is the tightly wound coil-like spring. For example, tobacco mosaic virus and rabies virus are helix-shaped, as shown in video. The scon shape is icoxedron shape. It ia a polyhedron 20 triangular faces and 12 corners, as herps simplex virus. Some viruses are complex-shaped. These are combinations of helix and icoschedron. For example, bacteriophages, which contains polyhedral capsid and helical tail. Structure of viruses. They have following important components. Envelope protein, genome, nucleocapsid, and envelope, etc. A protein coat called the capsid that protects the genetic material. And some viruses have an outer envelope derived from the host cell. What are prions? These are infectious particles made of proteins. It can also be defined as the normal proteins become folded incorrectly. Prions cause neurological degenerative disease like mad cow disease and scrapie, etc. Let's discuss difference between DNA and RNA viruses. The genome replication of most DNA virus take place in the cell's nucleus. They are entirely dependent on host cell, either double or single-stranded. While on the other hand, RNA viruses are unique viruses, as their genetic information is encoded in RNA and replicate in cytoplasm. Reverse transcribing viruses or retroviruses are a unique group of viruses that contain RNA as their genetic material. They utilize an enzyme called reverse transcriptase to convert their RNA into DNA, which can then integrate into the host cell's genome. Examples of retroviruses include HIV and the human T-cell leukemia virus. Thank you for your time and attention. Best of luck for your future.